tell me, Lime, why are we on the Cotswold Way at the moment? We're on the Cotswold Way because you're my lucky sucker friends. <laughs> So tell me, Mrs. V, what's in an energy ball? Dates, <laughs> cacao powder. In these, there are hazelnuts and almonds, coconut oil, flaxseed, hemp protein powder. Have I got everything? <laughs> We just stopped for lunch, and what's the first thing we've had to do? A hill. Quite a steep hill, quite a long drag, and uh, the benefit of the lunch has just worn off. <laughs> <laughs> So what do we think Mrs B? Your hard. first impressions? I found that hard today. Walk in the park but anyway. <laughs> Walk in the park. Good day. Day three done. Hey everyone, thanks if you tuned in to see episode one. I uh, significantly um, uh, overachieved in terms of number of viewers at uh, 50 odd, so uh, delighted with that. So here I am back for episode two. And what you saw today was uh, uh, day three of the Cotswold walk, one of our long distance walks that we're doing this year. And we did that with our friends, the Paulis that you saw, my our co-hosts uh, today. Uh, we've a plan to walk uh, the entire 110 miles of the Cotswold Way the whole uh, during the summer, and uh, we've already walked two parts of it. And unfortunately, it was before the vlog idea came to mind. Uh, but we've got plans to go back and uh, capture that for you as well. Um, we've already booked uh, another set of friends to join us on, on uh, stage one uh, and that uh, hopefully will be in the next few weeks. Uh, so um, once again the details of the walk, uh, should you be interested in that section and want to uh, follow in our footsteps, uh, they can be found below uh, in the description piece, uh, details of the uh, pub and uh, as I say the Cotswold Way walk and uh, uh, various other details. Uh, today's walk, give you the headlines, uh, it was uh, Hillene Parts, uh, walking on the ridge overlooking Cheltenham, uh, some fantastic views, not the clearest of days today, but nevertheless still some lovely, lovely views of uh, the, the Cheltenham countryside, some landmarks to spot, uh, steam trains going past uh, in the valley below, it's all very special. Um, about 17 miles, so it's a good full day's walk, uh, and uh, as a result, once again, we earned that pie. Uh, Mrs. B gave you a, a little bit of a, a rundown as to the um, energy balls that she makes. 
Um, credit goes initially to Deliciously Ella, and again, details below uh, for the, the basic recipe for those. Um, she'd modified the recipe very slightly, um, but it's our go-to snack on these sorts of walks. It's a you know, handy little morsel to have you know, to, to fuel you on your way. So, uh, what's up next? Well, uh, we thought we'd try and show you what sort of urban walking we do. So we've got uh, an idea for a uh, walk in central London and uh, hopefully uh, that might pique your interest. Uh, so look forward to seeing you next time and until then, happy feet.